hello everyone welcome back to my channel and today you can see i have created this beautiful eye makeup look this eye makeup look is uh, suitable for any indian pakistani or any south asian bride or maybe not south asian or any person who wants to do a little bit soft and a little bit classy sort of mixture of something so you can see i have created this look uh, with the very affordable brand uh, mostly products that i have used they are from elf cosmetics and how i have created this makeup look you can watch the tutorial but wait a minute don't forget to subscribe comment below and thumbs up to my channel so first i'm going to make my eyebrows and for making my eyebrows i'm going to use this elf brow pomade and it's a medium brown in color and the brush that i have taken uh, it, it has a little bit angle and another thing i have it's a, another brush set which is by elf i have done the review if you do not know these brushes are really good for a beginner so first you have to brush it like outward and in the direction of your own hair and then you need to load your brush with the brow pomade and for the next thing i'm going to use this essence i love stage eyeshadow base basically once i have done then i'm going to set this uh, eyeshadow base with the uh, mini so pore vanishing smoothing powder i still don't remember the full name of it it's a pressed powder you can either leave it in the same way or either you can do it but i really feel i have oily lid so if i don't do it my eyeshadow they do not stay or the base it just gets creased so i have to set it so after finishing my eyeshadow base what i'm going to do i'm going to use this elf rose gold palette if you remember i have used it um i think in my before makeup too i had one tutorial in which i have done the swatches and you know everything and how good this palette is and it's so um it's not expensive so first i'm going to use the lightest shade available on my palette and i'll go with this pink then i have made a v to elongate my eye and another thing i have done i have made a crease and i didn't close it here i have left it here. so there are other ways you can uh, do this either you can you know move it, it towards the inward of your eye and it's okay so the next shade which i'm going to use is this one and if you're seeing i'm using the same brush because i have applied the first the lightest color and then the darkest so i don't have any fear of merging it but uh, if i want to go for the lighter one i cannot use this one or you can wipe it in between since i'm applying the shade i'm blending it right away i'm not just not waiting for to blend it in the end and then we need another shade which is the darkest one and it's this one and at that time i will switch the brush and i'm using this elf uh, brush which is basically blending eye brush but it has less like this i think i will apply it on the side of my eyes and we are not going to blend it towards our crease I will build a little bit so after doing that I'm going to blend it with the circular direction I'm just blending it after that you need a concealer and we will do actually we will conceal this side and then we will apply the eyeshadow uh, and the concealer i'm using it's by fit me you can also use the eyeshadow base whatever you want and technically i'm just using it uh, to make my eyeshadow pr get more prominent and nothing else after applying the base i'm going to use this essence melted chrome eyeshadow i really love these eyeshadows they are really cool and they are very inexpensive so you can easily buy them and the color is golden brown i think they look better with the with your finger and the brush i'm using is eyeshadow brush L. i have mostly applied it with my finger and this time i'm trying with the help of brush this looks good more good with the help of finger than the brush after that i'm using this brush and what i will do i will just smudge both of these together 
just a little bit more the darker shade and then I'm going to conceal my under my eye and then doing the rest of my eye makeup. Then the next thing which I'm going to use is the e.l.f. loose powder and it's translucent in color. People call it as a dupe of Laurier Mercier. Uh, I want to apply something lighter here and a little bit darker here so I can connect both these shades together in the same dark shade which I used before that I'm going to use this, this shade which was the second nearest the darkest shade for my under eyes. the darker shade which we used on our outer crease for inner corner of our eye I'm going to use the same black uh, sorry I'm going to use the same eyeshadow which I applied on my lid so another thing which I'm going to do I have this next cosmetics uh, eye pencil it's in uh, pearl white color see my eyes they are looking more bright and then I'm going to curl my eyelashes so once I have curled my eyelashes I'm going to use this Clinique High Impact Mascara and I have done another review of Lancome and Clinique High Impact Mascara I'm going to use the uh, falsies and I will show you the final results just a little bit way. So this is my final look and what I have done I have applied a little bit eyeliner and then I have applied my false eyelashes. Uh, if you like my channel, if you like my videos, comment below, subscribe, thumbs up, bye bye.